As the holy month of Ramadan enters its first week, the Gaza Strip remains trapped in a cycle of relentless Zionist bombings. Each dawn brings fresh tragedy, as civilian homes are targeted without mercy. The recent Zionist strike hit the city of Deir el-Balah in the central Gaza Strip. While two families were about to gather to have their pre-dawn sahur meal, the houses were bombed and shattered to the ground, resulting in the death of 12 members. The house was destroyed, as you see, killing about 12 people, mostly women and children. The Israelis claim that the number of dead women and children is exaggerated. Let them go to the hospital and check with their own eyes. This new massacre adds to the already staggering toll, wiping out entire families, including infants, women and the elderly. There are no more children in Gaza. If we want to rebuild Gaza, it will take us many years. Look at the houses that were destroyed. There is nothing left. She's dead. All that's left is her dress. It's the greatest gift she gave us. In the past hours alone, the occupation forces unleashed nine horrific massacres across different parts of the Strip, leaving over 90 civilians dead. The aftermath reveals a scene of horror, with dozens still trapped under the rubble of destroyed buildings. Observers fear that the bloodshed in Gaza shows no signs of abating. The occupation forces seem determined to exterminate more civilians, perhaps in a bid to erase their defeat on October 7th.